Meantime, cities and towns are reeling from nearly busted snow removal budgets. We sent NBC 10's RJ Heim to find out what impact they'll have with more snow on the way. He joins us live now from the Down City Studios in Providence. Hi, RJ. Hopefully, uh, briefly, no hat, no gloves here. I'm sure I'll be wearing them at, uh, at uh, 6 o'clock and again tomorrow. There are five more weeks of winter left across the area. Everyone's looking forward to springtime, I think. And you know, it costs more for weekend storms, as uh, Dan alluded to. Rhode Island's two largest cities, Cranston and Warwick, they're prepared, but some of that money is running low. Most main roads in Warwick are down to bare pavement, but the piles on the sides keep growing. And with more snow in the forecast, a challenge. An average weekday storm costs $50,000 in this city. On average, weekend storms cost 25 to 50 percent more because of overtime. Our joke always used to be that um, when a storm hits on Sunday morning or Saturday morning, we know that Mother Nature has been in touch with the union. The city of Warwick's snow removal budget, $435,000 for this season. Guess how much is left? $18,000. What we do in, in our budgeting process is for the last 90 days of the fiscal year, we can move um, accounts that haven't spent all their money into cover accounts that have overspent. In Providence, main roads are passable, secondary and tertiary still an issue. The capital city has already spent two-thirds of its $1.6 million snow removal budget. So we have about $500,000 left in our, in our snow budget, which should get us through, through the rest, rest of the winter, regardless of where we are, that you know, the priority remains keeping the city safe, making our, and making our streets passable. Interesting fact here, the blizzard in Providence alone cost $750,000, and it cost $12,000 more per day for a storm, any storm, on a weekend in the capital city. Coming up at 6 o'clock, how the state of Rhode Island is doing with its snow removal budget. RJ Heim, NBC 10 News, live at our Down City studio in Providence.